Why, hello everyone. This is James coming at you with another awesome video about how to promote affiliate links online. Now, in this video, I'm going to share some strategies and techniques uh, about strategies that relates to email marketing. So, we're going to look at strategies and techniques uh, about email marketing. Now. If there's a video you would like for me to create, drop me a line, let me know, drop me a line, uh, leave a comment uh, about the video you would probably uh, would like for me to create. Okay, I do accept or request. Uh, now, uh, remember PMA, positive mental attitude. You must have a positive mental attitude. Battlefield of the mind. You got to get those negative thoughts under control. Kick those negative thoughts to the curb. Take massive action every day and be a person of gratitude. Success leaves clues. Success leaves clues. Uh, PMA, positive mental attitude. Uh, like, share, and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, also please subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Now, strategies. Uh, as I'm going to, this is what I'm going to talk about here. Some strategies. Uh, you need to track, track, track your open and click-through rate. Track your open and click-through rate so you can find out what's working and what's not working. Uh, use the automation uh, software. Automate this process. Okay. Uh, split testing. Do an A-B testing. This is these are great strategies. Uh, uh, email sequence, uh, follow up emails. Uh, make sure uh, your emails have your social media details. Social media details. Okay, number one tracking. Why should we track uh, open rate? Okay, now you, you need to track them so you know what's working. <clears throat> and what is not working. You want to be able to make an informed decision. And the way that you can make an informed decision is by tracking. Tracking. So you can find out what's working and what's not working. Let's uh, see. So track your emails so you can answer the following questions. One, how many recipients open my email? How many recipients open your email? What Second question is what links are being clicked, what's being clicked, and then what's the conversion rate. By tracking, you're able to answer these questions. Okay, number two, automation software. Automation software. Okay. Now, you need to make sure <clears throat> that you take time to get a good automation software. Now, the reason you need this it's because you don't have time to send emails out all day, okay? So you need some assistance, and you do this by getting uh, a good system that will you, you set the time and date that the email will go out. And then when that time and date arrives, it just goes out automatically. Okay, uh, the automation uh, using this uh, marketing technique uh, will save you time and money. Okay, now, when you're looking uh, for a, a, a tool, a, an automation tool, these are some of the features that it needs to offer. Okay, uh, <clears throat> segment, you must be able to, to uh, kind of uh, divide your emails into different segments. Uh, personalization, you want to personalize the email to the person, like include their name or something like that. Uh, Integration with apps, with other apps, okay? Do a split testing, A-B testing. Uh, you need a sign-in form. Make sure that it offers some type of sign-in form or sign-up form. And then uh, make sure that it's user-friendly templates, has user-friendly templates. So you need to be able to, to uh, uh, segment the, your emails, personalize them. Uh, integration with apps. Uh, A-B testing, sign-up form, and uh, user-friendly templates. These are tools, features that this marketing tool should have, which you should look for. 
uh, split testing, A, B, split testing. Now, it's very important that you that you split test your subject lines. Okay, you, you're going to do a comparison. You're going to create uh, two email subject lines, two email subject lines, and you want to find out which one performs the best. Okay, and you do this by an A, B test or split testing. So, <clears throat> you create the first subject line. And then you create another subject line. Okay. You create the first one and then create the other one. And now you begin to tweak. You tweak the first subject line or you can create an entirely different subject line. So you kind of get the results and you find out which one works and which one doesn't work. Uh, the one that doesn't work so well, you may want to tweak it a little bit. Okay. Uh, then you segment it into two different groups, two groups, segment, and then you use the first subject line, the group, one group get the first subject line, and then the other group get the second subject line, and then you see which subject line performs the best, which one has the best open rates. Okay, now. Uh, sequence, create an email sequence. This is extremely important. Create the, that sequence. Now, it takes uh, multiple attempts to get a response from the recipients. Okay, it's not going to be an instant response. Uh, they don't know you that well. So, as you send emails to them, they are beginning to know you. Uh, you are establishing yourself as the expert. Okay, so be patient, be patient. Be patient. This is why we do a series of emails. Okay, multiple attempts. Be patient. Uh, create a, a series of emails. This could be known as your marketing campaign. Your marketing campaign. Okay. And here are some preset intervals in which the emails can go out. Uh, day one, you can... Uh, do the initial email, day one, or day zero. Day one or day zero, do the initial email. Uh, then you're going to alternate days. Like This is like every two days. So you got day one, day three, okay, follow-up email. Day seven, send another follow-up email. And you could go through this. Let's say you create ten emails. So this could take you a, a month to go through that process. All right, this is a, that's a good way to do that. Okay, uh, now each each uh, uh, sequence will serve as a different purpose. It has a different purpose. Okay, uh, this process that you do that will let uh, the company know, will let your subscribers know more about the company. Okay, uh, engagement builds relationships. And it also establishes you as the expert in the field. They begin to look to you as a person that, that you know, that knows what you're talking about. <clears throat> uh, see, conversions. Okay, you want uh, conversions so that subscribers can take action. Take action. This is why you send an email, so that they can take action. Okay, now in your emails, you need to make sure that you include your social media details include your social media details uh, a lot of people today are using uh, mobile devices to check emails okay and so you want to include your social details okay the name of your social media account okay uh, such as Twitter LinkedIn Facebook these are examples of social media accounts okay All right, so let's do a quick review of the email strategies that one could use. Tracking, 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 email open rate. Track your email open rates. Automation, use automation, automation. Uh, split testing, A-B split testing, do a split test. Uh, email sequencing, this is kind of like an autoresponder. Email sequencing, follow-up emails. And uh, social media details. Include your social media details. 
All right. So this has been James. Uh, I'd like to thank you for viewing this video. Stand to the end. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, uh, success leaves clues. Okay, success leaves clues. PMA, positive mental attitude, is just no way around this. You must have a PMA. I want you to be able to say, the dream is true. I've been with, and I've been without, and being with is so much better. The dream is true. Kick those negative thoughts to the curb. PMA, positive mental attitude. This is a must. You must have a positive mental attitude. It's all about the mindset. The mindset, the mindset, the mindset. Uh, let's see. Oh, if there's a video you would like me to create, drop me a note. Drop me a note. Like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, uh, please do so. Let me speak this blessing over you. Until we meet again, may the Lord continue to bless you. May he smile upon you. May he grant you his favor. And may he continue to give you his peace. And may he also continue to enlarge your territory. This has been James. Have a great week.